that's uh, another one of our uh, bridge mounted swiveling standpipe style dry hydrants uh, using our angle mount. So this is in uh, Mount Airy, Maryland, which is in uh, central Maryland. This is a replacement to an existing one. And this uses our angle mount where the angle is bolted into the uh, guardrail posts. And uh, it's a good water hole here. It's not very wide, but it's uh, very deep. There's a good two and a half, three feet of water down there. Let's hop over this guardrail for a minute. Take a look from the other side. Plenty of water. So this is late, uh, excuse me, early August. So a fairly dry period in Maryland. But uh, a lot of good water here, so this is a good water hole for them. And so that's the installation, nothing fancy, six inch uh, PVC pressure pipe, so well casing type of pipe, schedule 40. Has the swivel mount there, has the uh, Kocheck teardrop strainer down there, and uh, Kocheck six inch male uh, suction head up above. So to deploy it, they simply pick it up, slide it over, turn it 90, turn it 90 degrees, drop it down in the water, and it rests on the bottom of the stream bed. So once it's loaded, all the water, uh, the weight of the water is carried on the bottom of the stream bed, which is, in this case, a good rocky stream bed. Does have a slight angle on it so that it drains in the wintertime. Don't have to worry about any condensation, ice buildup, whatever. Uh, the pipe is free and clear. You will notice that it's painted yellow. So uh, that's using a Krylon fusion paint, which is designed for outdoor plastics. Uh, so during your annual inspection of your dry hydrants and of your PVC plastic, you're going to want to make sure it is uh, covered with some kind of UV resistant paint. And that's it, nothing fancy. Uh, we will try to get a video of it in use uh, when we do a flow test on it. So this is just a finished installation. Oh, one other thing, there is a rope bag over there. It holds uh, half inch polypropylene rope. That is that is the mechanism for deployment and retrieval and stowage. Uh, so that's it. Again, uh, simply it was a replacement of an existing one, upgrade to our new design uh, using the uh, angle that's bolted into uh, the guardrail posts.